You are with Edochi Christ, as he confesses in secret letter to me, Edochi, breaking news. Hello people, welcome back once again to my YouTube channel. Yes, I've often said it here a countless number of times, that some men don't appreciate what they have until they lose it. Some people don't appreciate what they have until they lose it. That is when they will understand the value of what God gave to them. As I'm talking to you now, you the teacher have started crying out and confessing to me, Edochi, secretly and you think that probably people would not know about this you know, it is quite funny that a man allowed himself to be deceived it is quite funny that a man like you the allowed himself to be used by a stranger allowed himself to be deceived by a lady that ran away from her husband's house you know it is very very funny it is very very funny that you the allowed himself to be used to this particular extent a lot of men couldn't even think of bringing you to us, would never think of bringing you to us into their matrimonial home. A lot of men, look at Obi, uh, the Kobana chief priest. After this lover revealed that the you know, Kobana chief priest had a song with one Kenyan lady, the first and uh, most important thing that Kobana chief priest did was to protect his wife and his family. He said he's not going to bring in this Kenyan lady into the house as a wife. It's not gonna be, it's, it's not gonna be done or probably it's not going to happen. But look at you, the after spending 17 to 18 years with your lovely wife, after receiving all the blessings from God for the past 18 to 17 years that you've been married with me, Edochi, you decided to bring in somebody you claim that you made a mistake with into the house as your wife. You know, someone that has respect or dignity for marriage, the, for the marriage institution would never think of bringing in Jude Austin into his own matrimonial home, despite whatever thing that you've done with Jude Austin. But here, Edochi failed to understand this particular fact. Even when he was tendering an apology to me, Edochi, last year, you know, Yellow Edochi said something, that he never bargained to become a polygamist, that he never bargained to become a polygamist. That means it was a mistake that he made with Judy Austin. And the funny thing about Yellow Edochi is that he is so incoherent. Today he will come and apologize, tomorrow he will come and do another thing, meaning he is not even that mature, he doesn't have that self-resolution of his own. He's not that resolute. He cannot stand by his words. And he's this kind of person that can easily be tossed around by women. He made this particular statement last year that he he, he never uh, began to become a polygamist and all that. And we never even knew that Hilo Dichi had already gotten you to us and pregnant for the second time. Look at a man that is apologizing to his wife. Saying that he never began to become a polygamist. And he still had the F13 to go and impregnate Jude Austin for the second time. You know. His level of confusion is something that we, we don't even know how to address because today he will come and apologize, tomorrow he feels sorry, then next tomorrow you will, see the same, you will still see the same man apologizing to me, Duche, still flaunting Judy Austin, still doing all sorts of things with Judy Austin. And that is why a lot of people now believe that Yoda Duche is under the influence of something that is not even that matured. You know, this is exactly the way somebody acts, somebody that is under the influence of something acts because today the person senses will come back in the next minute. And his senses will just go off. And this is what Jude Austin is doing. Whenever Jude Ladichi wants to get himself, whenever Jude Ladichi wants to return back to his normal senses and mind, Jude Austin would, uh, would like say double or triple whatever thing that she used on Jude Ladichi, whatever kayamata she used. And Jude Ladichi will start misbehaving immediately. This was the same thing that happened after Kambeli Chuku died. After Kambeli Chuku died, Jude Ladichi, you know, returned back to his senses and immediately deleted all pictures and photos of Jude Austin on, on his social media accounts. And immediately he wanted to let Jude Austin to go. He wanted to let Jude Austin to return back to wherever she came from. And immediately Jude Austin saw the plans and everything. She quickly went and doubled and tripled. I don't know what she did. The Kayamata she used on Jude Ladichi. And immediately Jude Ladichi made a U-turn. So it's obvious that Yodo Dechi is under the influence of something. That is why he is actually not being steady. As I'm talking to you now, recently, uh, Jit Lover reviewed uh, a secret letter that Yodo Dechi wrote to me, Dechi, and he was crying in the letter. He was crying. I would, I would tell you people the content of this particular letter that, uh, that Yodo Dechi wrote to me, Dechi. Like I've said, May Duche's silence is killing this man. You know, he was thinking that May Duche will start, you know, being dramatic like him and Jude Austin. He was thinking that May Duche will start, you know, attacking him and all that without knowing that that lady is a very calm and a humble lady that knows what she actually wants for herself. In the letter, you know, Yale Duche was crying. You know, he's, he's, he's confessing to his wife, May Duche, that he doesn't know what is wrong with him. He sent the letter through... Uh, 
one of Meiduchi's friends, that he doesn't know what is wrong with him. That he doesn't really know. And equally in the letter, he confirmed that the pictures and the videos that Jude Austin has been posting we are made since last year. And they were just in his phone and in Jude Austin's phone and all that. And that Jude Austin has been the one uploading those pictures and videos on his social media accounts. He's even begging Meiduchi for Meiduchi to come back and all that. But the funny thing about this man is that he's worse. He, he, he's not something that one can actually hold strong onto because you don't know when he's serious. You don't know when he's actually uh, uh, being so uh, uh, corny and treacherous. Today he will beg you. Tomorrow he will still go back to Jude Austin and return back to his own vomit. So in the letter, and this letter was actually sent to Gistov, and this letter revealed this particular information to us, you know. He said Gio Ludici was begging Meiduchi. That he doesn't know what is wrong with him. Confessing how Jude Austin has been posting videos that they made since last year just to, you know, uh, uh, make me the to be more angry and all that. You could imagine. That, that is to say that you know, the DJ, you know, does not have a power of his own. You know, a man should take charge of his family. You don't allow ladies to toss you around. And this is the mistake he made. This was the reason why Jude Austin tossed him around to the extent that Jude Austin trapped him down with pregnancy. When Jude Austin saw that Yolo Deche, you know, probably might leave her, she trapped him down again with, with a second pregnancy. And Yolo Deche, not having that self-control, not, not have, having that self-will, decided to fall for Jude Austin's trap. And now, he's sending secret messages to Mei Deche. Because he knows that Mei Deche, nobody can replace that woman. He knows that even Jude Austin cannot replace Mei Deche. The qualities and everything that that lady gave to him. Nobody can replace that woman, and that is and this is why why Yoledeche is actually running her task getter, trying to reconcile with Meiduchi. But you should know that there is no reconciliation without restitution. You must make restitution. You must make amends for what you did. No matter how much or how many times you apologize to Meiduchi, she will only be convinced. Even we, the online in-laws, will only be convinced if and only if you make restitution by returning Jude Austin. And you know, declaring that you are no longer interested in her. That is the only time we will take you serious. That is the only time Mei Duchi would even accept this letter and all the apologies and all the things that you've been sending to her. You must come out with a firm resolution and a, and a firm decision. You have to be decisive. You don't have to be tossed around by Judy Austin and her cohort deceiving you every now and then. That is just the truth. Well, all I guys should drop a comment in the comment section and equally subscribe to my YouTube channel.